as our aerial coverage is brought to you by Goodyear, the official tire of NASCAR, helping NASCAR drivers get to the finish line for over 50 years. Got to tell you, it's going to be hard to get by that Toyota, the way that thing runs. But I tell you, Greg Biffle in that 16 car, he has been trying to push his teammate, Matt Kenseth, to the lead, and he'll take it down the back straightaway. A Ford has not oh. led. Look at Kurt Busch in the two car all the way into the infield grass. If Kenseth can hold it around to the line at lap 107, seven laps past halfway, a Ford will lead the 500 for the first time today. And we've all said all week long, for most part, What's wrong with those cars? But I don't think it must be anything wrong with them way they're running right now. What they just need a long way to get going. Oh, car two got into the back of Earnhardt Jr. Now Denny Hamlin was right in the middle of that. Here's what he saw. Still outside, still there. Oh, that's what happened. Dale Jr. moved over, and here comes kind, of, kind of bad timing. Junior moves just about the time. It looked like Kurt was going to go around, too, and all of a sudden, off the track. Matt? Mike, Kevin Harvick just keyed his mic, and he says, did you just see that? The two just went through the grass. <laughs> and his spotter says, I saw that. He goes, I know, he just went through the grass.